Local volunteers from the American Red Cross have deployed to North Carolina. News 10's Madison Zaleski joins us now live in the studio. She tells us one man's mission to help people in need. Patrice Rondrell volunteers with American Red Cross help people who are displaced from their homes and need help immediately. I spoke with a volunteer who traveled south to help with recovery efforts from Hurricane Helene. Joe Young started volunteering with the American Red Cross when Hurricane Katrina devastated the Gulf Coast. Since then, Young has responded to several other hurricanes, but he says Hurricane Helene hits differently. My first deployment was Hurricane Katrina, and I don't think I've been in a disaster as big as that since then, but this is coming close. Red Cross volunteers have been traveling to the hardest hit areas, but volunteers like Young have had some trouble getting to their designated locations. Power lines down, so we stopped the vehicle to survey the area. I walked uh, down the road a little bit, and part of the road was just missing. You know, it was along a river. There was a river right along the road, and the bank had eroded and taken part of the road with it. When Young gets to Bakersfield, North Carolina, his job is to prepare shelters and distribute emergency supplies. And from what I hear, they don't have much set up right now. Uh, they're still working on getting cots in and stuff like that. So we'll probably be getting cots in, setting those up and uh, getting the shelter ready for um, people that need uh, help. Each Red Cross deployment typically lasts two weeks, but Young says he could be there longer. Despite the challenging situation, Young feels it's his obligation to donate his time to help people directly. This is my country. These people are fellow Americans. I just feel the need that I just know that if I was in that situation, I would hope that there was somebody to help me. If you're interested in donating for hurricane relief or volunteering, you can find that information over on our website. Patrice Rondrell, back to you.